In the news right now, ABC News confirmed Tyree Nichols' autopsy revealed he died from blunt force trauma. The report shows his alcohol level was 0 .049. That's below the legal limit of 0 .08. And that conflicts with the information his mother was told on the night he was beaten. She says she was told Tyree was drunk and high at the time of the incident, and Nichols died January 10th in Memphis. Video footage of that night showed the father beaten, tased, and pepper sprayed by now former Memphis police officers. Attorney Ben Crump said the official autopsy report further propels our commitment to seeking justice for this senseless tragedy. We will update you on air and online once we get a copy of Tyree Nichols' autopsy.